The driver who hit and killed a bicyclist in downtown Madison earlier this month could be facing legal trouble. The 57-year-old victim was hit on East Washington Avenue July 2nd. Officers say he was in a crosswalk when it happened. Police did not cite the driver, but now that person could be charged. New at 6, Tony Galley tells us what's changed in the investigation. Staff at this McDonald's restaurant says after David Frischkorn had coffee and conversation here, he left on his bike to be almost immediately hit on East Washington Avenue. Frischkorn's fatality, the fourth this year for either a bicyclist or pedestrian on this thoroughfare. Police officials said the driver who hit Frischkorn around 7 in the morning was not arrested or cited. No obvious issue with her driving. But that's changed. Police are recommending the driver be charged with driving without a license causing death. A spokesperson says the district attorney could also consider reckless or negligent homicide. This apparent memorial to bicyclist David Frischkorn joins other memorials on this major thoroughfare and it reinforces, if there was even a reason for that, the perils of East Washington Avenue for cyclists and pedestrians. A lot of things happen on the avenue. With this bicyclist death as the result of allegedly suspect driving, Madison Police Lieutenant Harrison Zanders says a common theme continues here. We're reaching out to our partners to come up with best, better solutions to address this issue. Authorities say the community of drivers must also buy in, with consequences for those who would miss, ignore, disregard pedestrians and bicyclists sharing this road. In Madison, Tony Galley, 27 News. Authorities have not identified the 28-year-old driver who collided with Frischkorn. His death happened just blocks away from the hit-and-run death of a pedestrian five days earlier.